already embedded in education. Have for a part-time education program. He needs that in order for students to become entrepreneurs and solve. My name is Ernest, and I'm a policy debater. My name is Omar Price, and I'm the Duval High School debate coach. Go Tigers! My name is David Trigo. I'm the program director of the Washington Urban Debate League. By implementing our alternative to standardized tests, Ernest is low key. He would be a great poker player because he does not show his hand in his face that often. I'm not really that soft-spoken in debate. I tend to actually be the loudest person in the room. This is the link that's affirmative brought up. Other than being good at attacking people's arguments, you get good at thinking fast. It's a good mental exercise. He's probably the hardest worker we have. Debate is, in some ways, a unique, safe space where students can experience loss and develop perseverance and grit. They not only have the intellectual skills to know what they're talking about, but they have the confidence and the poise to actually execute. But I think that the biggest underrated academic improvements debate can help bring to a student are in the harder sciences and, and math. I'm into business and entrepreneurship. I started an online e-commerce business in which I sell items from China and then I ship them directly to my buyers. Initially, I foresaw him as a scientist, as a college professor. I want him to do something that he really loves and really get a good living out of it. Our advantages of solving poverty. I want to go to college at NYU, and I want to be a film director. I want to go to University of Maryland and major in physics. Between mechanic and aeronautical engineering, I want to be a chef and I want to go to the Culinary Institute of America. I have like open options right now because I'm in ninth grade. I'm thinking like an engineer, lawyer, or like a doctor. Well, I want to become an FBI agent, but I'm really big on history. With the goal of producing more STEM workers. It's a chance to get better grades in classes. Like I've learned new words, chance to get a step up in life and have better opportunities. This is our third complete season as a debate league, and actually I would say that the feeling right now is about supercharged growth. The number of students um, has almost doubled in one year, and we can see adding a lot more students in schools as the years go on. For a new league to have over 40 schools, over 150 students participating at every tournament, growth, growth, growth is the mood of the league right now. We're so proud. It's just an incredibly rewarding, gratifying experience. For the donors of the debate, I would say that I'm very grateful for them because the debate would not be accessible to everyone or schools that cannot afford to pay the teacher or to provide the resources. And also for the judges that judge and use their Saturdays. So we rely on those donors and very grateful for them.